Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Um, so I have downgraded my graphics a ton. I'm basically doing 99.99% of all vanilla textures. So, um, even though I want to use... Well, okay, so let me start here. Basically, last episode, we did a lot of boring stuff. You know, we... What we essentially did is discover all of these while also doing a quest over here, which is Bio Gulch Mine, um, and everything. So, yeah. So I figured we would head Don't over. Let my brother get to you. Uh, excuse me. Start heading over fight, to. Um, Thank you, sir. White Run and everything i also got rid of a lot of my like like i said i'm, I'm using like 99.99 percent of texture mods i'm not really using major grass mod i'm not using didn't do lot i'm not using um none of that because i want to experience the vanilla game for a little bit plus i think it's i noticed it I'm starting to notice that my computer is having troubles just handling the graphics mods that I have, which are not that much. But, uh, it's honestly not that much. But I do have blended roads. Um, I'm not using any major texture pack or anything like that. Be butterfly wing. Okay, I do. Um, going to health. I should put some stuff into smithing. Start that. Eventually, I wanted to go into Dage, well, dragon smithing and stuff. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I'm going to save. Why not? That was Discord. <laughs> I wonder what Discord wanted. Oh, it's probably my video uploading. It is nice doing all this at a smooth frame rate. It really is. It, it makes the game more enjoyable. Now, I know you guys like, uh, are used to seeing on my channel, um, a lot, like a heavily modded game and everything, but honestly, 
I'm at the point where I don't want to hurt my computer any more than I... I, I mean, I don't want to hurt my computer any more than it already is. Ha! Found you! Wait, what? Uh, oh. me? Oh, hello. Yeah. Yeah. Nice to... As instructed, you are to eliminate Frendar Hunding by any means necessary. The Black Sacrament has been performed. Somebody wants this poor fool dead. We've already received payment for the contract. Failure is not an option, Astrid. Um. Well, I pissed off somebody. I pissed off somebody. I've been hunting, fishing in these parts for years. Take a look. Fight well. Didn't think there was an ice wolf around here. What's a milk drinker like you doing out here? Why? What are you gonna do? Cry? I don't have to take that from you. All right. You wanna go? Ah! Oh, shit. Shit. Come on. 
on what okay you know what i'm just gonna travel to riverwood fuck this shit <laughs> Actually, on. Sure as bones, a handsome man in Falkry. Important deliveries to make. No time for chatting. Kill the horse. I hate myself. Well, I died from a horse. I just want to go to Riverwood. Is that too much to ask? along no more stops we need to find our way to solitude why are we even going to a wedding at this far-flung end of the empire anyway i told you it's the wedding of vittoria vici an extremely well-connected merchant of the east empire
Why is it all of a sudden becoming gray? Foggy. Can't beat me. Ah, so oh, burn. That's your best, huh? That takes care of that. Well, that's taken care of. Pathetic mortal. You will be reduced to <laughs> criminal. Conceive of the power I wield. Ah! You think I'm afraid of you? I am master of the arcade. This one has something sweet for the fellow. The finest skooma. The sweetest moon. Sh ah, a snitch, eh? Last mistake. Die, damn you!
Good fucking god. Get away from me, you fucking ass spider. You can't win this. Yeah. Why are you attacking me? Ha! Like the bite Is of that a your sleeve. best, huh? Come on. Enough. Let's see this ends up. now. Oi. Damn you. I'm so confused. Give me a second here. From what? My order of the yard. Stop right there. Oh, forgive me, Thane. I didn't realize it was you. We'll look the other way this time. But even the Jarl's influence has its limits. Be more careful. Uh, okay. When did I get a... 40 gold bounty. I'm so confused. Been a long time since I've had a bounty in Skyrim. Very long time, actually. <laughs> All right, what actually? Hold on. What? Uh, I have the Warrior Stone. Let's do the thief stone for a little bit. All right. Put it in. I'm gonna keep that. Yeah, I'm gonna keep that.
I think my any settings um, reset itself. It's been a while since I've been here, because I've been in Falkreath this whole this whole time. Okay, I'm going to because I want it to be daytime. Beautiful day. What is this texture? What's this texture? That's weird. That's weird. Oh, I didn't even notice this. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. There's a new museum opening up in Dawnstar. The owner is asking me to hand out invitations to travelers. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Cool. You looking for a hmm blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Good day. Hmm, blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit. Until next time. All right, so what do we need to do? We need to go to Halted Street Camp, which I'm not looking forward to. Um, well, we might be able to do it. We might be able to do it.
all except for the bandit chief that's the that's the only downside sworn there was an iron ore vein somewhere around here. We are wrong. I could have sworn there was like some iron ore veins around here. Could be wrong though. I honestly have no idea. Is someone there? <laughs> Not bad. Not bad. Corundum. Come on. Thought I heard something. That's all you got? Yeah. I'll tell you what. You start running, so I can on, stab you in the you back. Please don't kill me! Are you prepared to- oh. 
<laughs> he says, please don't kill me as I proceed to kill him. This was another location that I uh, walked through, and basically what it essentially is is that technically it's an unmarked location, but, you know, it actually has a... Uh, the weapons themselves are not unique, but the enchantment is that you can get here. Um, Elemental Bolt. Um... So these weapons, the lunar uh, weapons, essentially, well, you can't really see it on the screen, but um, essentially what they do is they, well, okay, so let me read it. Let, let, let me read this real quick and I'll explain why this book is kind of misleading. Um, I've managed to get the forge up itself up and running but again i find nothing special about its workings these weapons were clearly forged here yet the secret of their enchantment remains elusive all i have been able to discern so far is some connection between the weapons power and the appearance of the moons the weapons themselves are crafted of what seems to be normal metal but while the moons are high above they gain an additional ability it seems that once the sun has gone down, the lunar weapons take on a vampire-like ability, transferring a small amount of health from the victim to the user. And as I mentioned in my video, uh, that is indeed not how they work. As a matter of fact, it's actually the exact opposite. Um, so they don't ha take on a vampire-like ability. Basically, when the moons are up and when the moon is full, uh the target uh when you hit them actually glows like a like a bright white i think um like for example um these uh hold on basically while the moons are out burns the target for 10 points of damage so basically what it initially does is not only burns the target but the targets themselves actually glow and it's a pretty cool enchantment and, and it actually is a very useful enchantment or very early on in the game so when you're level three or higher it is always highly recommended to come here very early on because that way you could get the best um version of this enchantment of course i'm level 22 so the weapons are basically useless to me anyways so but you can indeed disenchant them definitely can you definitely can disenchant them. I want to go in. Over here. 
here. Trying so hard not to hit Rhea. You pay for that? You think I'm afraid of you? I'll rip your heart out. Son of a That's it. That's all you've got. Come on, show me what you got. He just got pelted with arrows, my god. A whole lot of arrows to right to the booty. Excuse me. Someone there? Ha! Found you. Come on! Come on! Get her, Rita, get her. Like the bite of a flea. What can I do for you? Ooh, dwarven arrows. Nice. Here is some more. These are usually these are steel. Um you know, but they're iron for some reason. I didn't want to pick up the lantern. Oh, hello. Come on, Saber Cootie. Come on. Yeah. Where is she? Yeah. Totally take took care of that. It's always so humbling watching ma mammoths close to you. 
or seeing a mammoth close to you. Very humbling indeed. I think I'll do this location and then retire someday. Give myself an island. Go to the college. Use your smarts. Like I'm supposed to figure out which college he meant. Be someone there. Victory for now. I'm getting arrows. Picky pockets. Now that's the real life. No rough stuff. Just take it and go. Talks to me like that again. Get him while he's sleeping. Or poison his meat. See how he likes that. <laughs> Is someone there? What was that? Over here. Get him, Maria. You need to do better than that. I will Can't destroy wait you. To count out your coin. Any armor? Oh hell yeah! <laughs> Rhea, come here, my love. What can I help you with today? I met your service. Oh my god! I just hit the bloody jackpot. Please call upon me if I can be of any service. I mean. Hey, I'll take it. I'll, I'll, I'll bloody take it. I'll take it. 
Because I thought the bandit, the bandit chief in here was going to be a little bit t t tougher than he already was, um, and everything. But whatever. Anyways, guys, I'll end the episode there. Sorry about the hour-long episode, the last two hour-long episodes, and also sorry about um the my TV coming through the mic. I don't know if you could hear it last episode, but I guess I I could hear it um because it was very it wasn't as noticeable but it was noticeable and uh yeah so my tv kind of i think i guess i had my tv too loud and i guess it kind of peeked through the mic just a hair just a hair um but anyways i hope you all enjoyed this episode guys and i will catch you all in the next one fantastic day all for the pack